a lot a lot a lot so a lot of you guys have been wondering okay i'm gonna stop acting like that a lot of you guys have been wondering how you aim how do i aim well i really can't answer any of that for you because it's really all for you to learn but i can show you how i do it so in town you're gonna want to be able to shoot people right you want to be able to aim at them so the first thing you're gonna need to understand is your sensitivity just like most fps games honestly i'm i'm just a casual player who can just so I happen to shoot people a little bit better than others can. So my sensitivity, I play at 0.07 sensitivity. I use a mouse DPI of 800, 600, and 400. It just depends on what I'm feeling. If you aim down sights and you scroll up or down, you can actually change your ADS sensitivity. You can go up or down all the way to here. I really don't recommend going like anywhere down from like this. 0.65. I usually go about 0.85 just because I still prefer to be able to turn. A lot of people not like this because it's really slow. I mean, for a lot of people it's really slow. I mean, I have to turn my mouse like... You can see my arm moving in the camera. So, I mean, for my cursor speed, I use 10. It's the perfect middle. It's 10. In case you haven't noticed yet, my side button on my mouse is actually bound to Q. Just because I can lean better with it. When I'm leaning this way, I don't need it. When I lean over here, it just makes things easier. I use it in Siege too. You might notice that my game looks a little funky, especially my chat. I use something called Block Strap. You can kind of configure your game in a way that makes it run better and smoother, which is what I did. I'll leave my Block Strap Fast Flag presets down in the description. I'll even link, I'll leave a link to how to install Block Strap for those who don't know how. I'm not a tutorial guy. I don't even know how to make this video. I don't know what I'm doing. I really don't. I don't know what I'm saying, what I'm doing. Now, you may notice in some of my videos, I do use a low resolution. I use 800 by 600, 165 hertz. Now, I don't use 800 by 600 for the reason you might think. Like, I don't use it because everything is stretched. I actually used to not even use it stretched. I actually used to play 4-3 no stretch. It just kind of got annoying with the bars that being there, so. But the reason I actually do it is because the gameplay feel it just feels smoother. I feel like I can move my mouse, I can understand where my mouse is going to go. I know where I'm going to be looking at. It makes me feel better and I feel like I can hit my shots a lot more because it's a lot smoother. I'm not sure exactly what it is, but if I had to guess, it'd probably be something with the amount of pixels. Maybe like you can... Less pixels means less updates that your computer has to make, or your graphics card has to make, which means less input delay. That's just an assumption. I have no idea if that's actually the case or not. It doesn't really help with your FPS much at all, so... I mean, mine it doesn't, because my graphics card is kind of overkill for Roblox. However, this game is really CPU bound because, unfortunately, I don't think this game really uses multi-threaded rendering. Do I still have my birthmark? You guys like my birthmark? I don't know if you can see it or not. Got a little birthmark right here. Anyways, I don't know why I had the... I don't know why I had the... Okay. I don't know why I felt so compulsed to show you guys that. <laughs> I don't use it for the stretch, I use it for the smoother gameplay. 1080p 4x3, it, it's not really exactly the same, but it, I can definitely feel that it's a little bit more smooth than when I just play in 16x9. Feels smooth, responsive, and that's really the only reason I'd use 4x3, especially more in the lower resolutions. PC specs. My PC has an 11th gen Intel Core i5, 11400F, clocked in at 2.6 gigahertz 16 gigabytes of ddr4 memory why is that 240 wait and i have a geforce rtx 3050 i really don't know what more you guys would want from this video but yeah ff flags in the description if you want them if you want to try them out at all siege video state of anarchy videos and a bunch of other games hopefully i can upload them and you guys will maybe enjoy them i can't wait